Okay, welcome to the lesson. Today, what we'll learn is how to create and register for a Kahoot account. So let's go into our web browser and do a search for Kahoot register. And you'll be looking for the link that actually says register. Okay, it's Kahoot IT register. Now, it will ask you immediately how you want to use it as a student or work or socially. We will select it as a teacher. You do have the option here whether you want to sign in with a social media account like Google or Microsoft. We'll look at that in a minute. Right now I'll show you what it looks like if you try to sign up with an email. Um, so the choice is yours. You can choose how you want. First of all, you don't need to add your school. That is optional. But you certainly need to put what level uh, your workplace is. So uh, you can put other if you like. Uh, I'll just keep it as higher education. Your username, you will need to select one. So think of one, and if there's any problem with it, they'll tell you. But you'll pick a username. You'll have to add your email address. And uh, so don't forget to put your email address and your password. That will be important. The critical thing here is before you join, you should click on this, I have read and agree with the Kahoot terms and conditions. Okay. Now, I will show you how to sign in with a... Uh, social media account. Let's go for example to Google. It will show you a window and you will select on your window what Google account you want to link it with. And from here now we can go ahead and put in our uh, selected uh, nickname. It may give you some options. So if I don't put anything there it will show me some. I'm going to try one now. Mm -hmm. And we will go ahead and that's that's accepted. I'm going to go ahead and join. You'll see that it's already showing me I have read and agreed. This has already ticked that box for the terms and conditions. That's great. Okay, we will go ahead. Mm -hmm. And we're in. Now, the great thing is there's lots of options for uh, paying for this product. But if you scroll all the way down, there is also a free option. So if you do like the product and you want to um, get some of the extra features normally not available. But for our purposes, um, we're okay with the existing free features. And certainly great as it is already. I've clicked on that. Now, welcome. And I will say, my name is Marco. I'll put that in. And there we go. You'll be able to see a whole uh, heap of things on the web page, on the uh, home page. But for now, that's all we need to do. Uh, one other thing, when it does, because this is the free version, if it keeps asking you about the upgrade option, so upgrade to pro, if it keeps showing you the page to upgrade uh, you got two choices to get out of this page because some people get confused and they think oh no no I, I have to upgrade if you don't want to you don't have to it is your choice you can either continue here at the bottom or you can click on Kahoot at the top there and it will take you back to your um, home page so um, every now and again it may try to advertise and that may pop up but no cause for alarm it's all good and in the next uh, lesson, we'll look at how to actually create a Kahoot. But for now, that's it for this lesson. Thank you.